All right, hey, it's Tim with a thought in the scripture. It's been about a week. I'm sorry, I've been uh, facing some annoyances and, for that matter, some significant challenges. However, uh, like Job when he was tested, I'll just quote him. Job 19, 25. He says, For I know that my Redeemer lives, and that he shall stand at the latter day upon the earth. And though after my skin worms destroy this body, yet in my flesh shall I see God, whom I shall see for myself, and mine eyes shall behold and not another. For I know my Redeemer lives. And no matter what happens, I will see God. No, I can't earn it. No, I can't do it for myself. Jesus paid for our sin. And he bought my ticket home. See, no matter what's going on in your life, no matter what's happening... If you repent, and that means turn. If you turn from your own worries and your own concerns and your own desires. And you get your mind on Jesus. He says, Him who comes to me I will in no wise cast out. He'll take care of you. And yes, there are promises for this life but you know let's let's be honest sometimes we screw things up one old pastor I used to sit under Elvin Norsworthy used to say that you know some of us are so busy hurting ourselves that the devil can go on vacation he don't need to bother with us and uh, sometimes in this life it's a little hard to tell is this my fault is this an actual attack from the spirit world But you know that time, it's in the Gospels, look it up, where some man had some malady. I don't remember if he was, I think he was blind. He had or he couldn't walk. And the disciples asked, who sinned, uh, this man or his parents, that he was born blind? Yeah, he was born blind. Look it up. And Jesus said, neither did this man nor his parents sin. Or at least that that, that was not the the main cause of it. And he said, but, and watch this, and he healed the guy. You see, that's what Jesus does. He shows up, no matter what the problem is, no matter what the cause is, and if you let him, he says, but, and he takes care of it. Yeah, I know my Redeemer lives. I know that my Redeemer lives. And at the latter day, he will stand upon the earth. He's going to rule and reign, and I'm going to see him. And you can have that too, if you'll just turn to him. And no matter what is happening, has happened, or will happen, you can be assured, if you turn to him, of eternal salvation. It's uh, 15 August, 2023. 2023 Anno Domini. And I know that my Redeemer lives. God bless y'all. Catch you later.